producer, program director, congregation of the Festa, friends and family, a Kamenga Yesu Fest, Jambudis. Uh, I was given the honor and the privilege this evening of doing the vote of thanks. And um, as I do that, I would like to um, extend a very huge thank you to the hands and the prayers that helped put together this amazing evening uh, tonight. Uh, from, from, the help, from the hands that helped uh, in the kitchen uh, with, with, with coffee to preparing the, the books this evening and ushering in, we'd like to thank you. Making your voice count. A theme that reminds us that, and you were correct, program director, you spot on, uh, in saying that Uput Slangula's speech was a journey, a hero's journey, if you will. And making our voices count is a theme that reminds us that as living arrows, we are sent forth by life as it uses us in its many bows. Life pulls you back with all its might that its arrows may go swift and far. And as you experience this tension, be mindful that soon you are to be sent forth. As we proceed in due course, making our voices count with these healing truths, let us remember not to be consumed by our own individuality, for that is the spine of the ego. For obsession with one's own individuality obscures one from the truth, that it is with this exaggerated state of self-importance that leads to agitation and disappointment. This deluded belief in one's importance is made all the more fascinating because this objective attachment to your identity is so far from the truth that one's true identity is transcendental. I thank you, Dolo, for bringing forth these healing truths and reminding us to make our voices count. I thank you. Thank you, thank you and thank you. Thank you for the gift of your time. Thank you for the gift of lending Sambule and here. And, and, and thank you just for your presence.